right, so throughout this video, we're going to talk about creating your own St. Patrick's Day rhythms using images. Now, if you are at home and not face-to-face, -face, you might just need to have multiple tabs open on your iPad, or um, if you go to the YouTube uh, page that um, this link sent you to at the very bottom of the video, you'll see a link if you want to print out these pages and cut up the images and put them into the template. So there's multiple ways to do this, whichever is easiest. Um, so for everyone else, or now that we're all on the same page, you're going to see multiple images throughout this video, and then when you go and create your own in a moment, what you're going to see is we're going to see gold. Okay, very important that we only say gold. Gold is like our quarter note or our ta. It gets one sound, gold. Okay, we'll also see rainbow, kind of like our T T or our eighth notes. There's two sounds, okay, and each image fits in its own box. Each box is one beat. Okay. You will then see four leaf clover, and those are four that we're going to put together. So it's kind of like our 16th notes. Okay. Um, yeah. So, and then you're also going to see a little emoji face that has a zipper, and that's like our silence. So that's like our rest or quarter rest because it only goes in one bar. So here's what we're going to do. Uh, there is in the in the link, there's a little kind of shout out box, and it says click or click track, click that to get your tempo. So for every click that you hear, you're gonna say one square at a time. So here is what I need you to do if you are um, at school or you are face to face. I need you to go into your seesaw or your canvas. Okay. Um, Kinder through third, uh, we're going to stick with y'all for this one. So you're going to go to your Seesaw account, make sure you change classes so that you are in specials. Okay, and remember, um, if you've had me, we go through the same process. Make sure you click the light bulb, okay, and then make sure you click that gray folder or that blue folder underneath, and then click on music, okay. We are going to see template, St. Patrick's Day template that has our pictures on there, okay. Click on the picture, okay? So when you click on it, you're going to be able to move and drag those pictures into the box. So here, we're going to do some copy ones first. So here's what I want you to do. I want you to put down, and we're only going to do the first four, gold, gold, rainbow, gold. Can you match my picture? And if you need to pause, go ahead and pause. Let's make sure everyone gets that. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play our click track, our metronome, okay, and we're going to say the pictures in order for every click. Make sure it's not too loud. Okay, you hear it? So each picture is on the click. Ready, set, here we go. Gold, gold, rainbow, gold. How'd you do? Let's go backwards. Here we go. Gold, rainbow, gold, gold. Okay, good. Now, let's go down to the next uh, row, or you can put the images back. But I need you to do this picture now. I want you to do rainbow, gold, our zipper, and rainbow. Okay. So pause, get these pictures on, rainbow gold, our silent sky, and rainbow. Okay, we're going to say those pictures, okay? Ready and set, and here we go. Rainbow gold, rainbow. Now let's go backwards, here we go. Rainbow gold. Rainbow. Awesome job. Clear those out. Let's do this one. Okay. Gold. Rainbow. Four leaf clover. Gold. Okay. Put these pictures down. All right. And pause if you need time to set it up. <laughs> okay. Ready. Here we go. Gold, rainbow, four leaf clover, gold. Do that one again. Four leaf clover is kind of fast. Ready, set, and here we go. Gold, 
rainbow, four-leaf clover, gold. Now let's go backwards. Here we go. Gold, four-leaf clover, rainbow, gold. How'd you do? Hope you did good. Now here's what we're going to do. One more kind of practice round. And you're going to do your own. So let's do this. Let's do our silence. Okay. Four-leaf clover. Silence again. Rainbow. Okay. So add these pictures on. Get them set up in your seesaw or if you printed them out in person. All right. Ready and set. And here we go. Four-leaf clover. Rainbow. Let's do that one again. Ready and here we go. Four-leaf clover. Rainbow. Now let's go backwards. Here we go. Rainbow. Four-leaf clover. Let's do that one again. Ready and here we go. Rainbow. Four-leaf clover. Right. So now here's what I want you to do. You've got four different pictures and you have four different rows. I want you to fill all the squares, okay? Each row, you're going to read it in order, kind of like we read words in a book. You go line by line by line. So any combination that you want, okay? Then we're going to pause for a second. Then I'm going to play the track. Everybody is going to say their own at the same time. So yours might not be the same as your neighbor. Okay. We'll do line one and then we'll pause. And we'll do line two and then we'll pause. We'll do line three, pause, four, pause. Okay. And I'm going to do my own too. So mine might be different than yours and that's okay. We're going to get creative. So go ahead, pause if you need to. Fill your entire sheet. Now that everyone's ready, we're going to do line one, just your top row, okay? Ready, set, all together, here we go. Four leaf clover, gold, rainbow, gold. Okay, that was line one. It's kind of a little crazy, I'm sure, okay? Let's do line two this time, so the second row. And you can totally point as we're doing all this, totally fine. You can even clap along any way, which is easier, okay? Line two now, okay? Ready and set. Line two. Here we go. Gold. Four leaf clover. Ooh, how did you do? Okay, hopefully it's still different. You're mixing it up. All right, let's do line three this time. Okay, so go into that third line. Ready, set. Here we go. Four leaf clover. Rainbow. Gold. How'd you do? Now, let's do our last line. So that bottom row right there, okay? Ready and set, and here we go. Rainbow, four leaf clover, four leaf clover. All right, how'd you do? Hopefully you had a lot of fun with that. Now, if there's extra time in your class, because I know we're doing things a little different this week, um, or even at home. I've given you that click track. Okay, you just click that button in your seesaw and it pulls up another page. Just press play, let it go while you do it on another tab. This is totally fine. Okay, you can also do this um, some more on individually um, in class if you have some time. So that's creating your own rhythm. And in the template, if you want to, send me a screenshot of the one that you just created. That would be super cool. So have fun with this and let's learn a new song.